Happy Valentine's Day, Stars fans. The Stars are back at the Icebox tonight to take on the Sioux City Musketeers. My name is Tim Mulhaupt, and this is your game day preview, brought to you by Hall's Culligan Water. Coming off a tough weekend in Youngstown, the Stars look to build off of positive developments in terms of developing the identity of being a hard team to play against. Coming out of Saturday, I felt better about our response. I felt better about uh, the team that we were leaving that game. Obviously, the results are, are what they are, and, and um, you know we want to improve on the results. Yeah, I'm really happy to see that. I'd like to I'd like to leave a good impression, uh, you know, with whoever uh, whoever I'm with and whoever I'm around. And I, you know, it's it's really great to see a team come together like that and stick up for each other. One of the key pieces in the Stars' search for the right identity is assistant captain Tristan Ashbrook. The second-year forward has posted three goals in his last two games and has found his groove in the second half of the season. Of late, he's especially played well alongside Mikey Colella and Ross Mitten. Yeah, there's not a, a bad combination of guys in our lineup right now. Uh, we've found some success lately, and I've gotten some personal success as well through those guys and through just working hard and staying out the process and, and focusing on doing little things right. The Stars got some good news this week as Zach Dubinsky has returned to Lincoln. The second year forward has missed much of the 2018-19 season recovering from an injury sustained at the beginning of the year. As he returns to game strength, the Stars will look to Dubinsky to add further positive impact to the dressing room. It's great to have him back and you know obviously he's um, not quite there yet to jump into a game but uh, his presence in the locker room is important. We have missed, uh, we missed Zach a lot this year, uh, not just because of the type of player he is but what he brings to our locker room and, and when we talk about those non-negotiable things, part of our identity and culture, you know, working, competing, uh, tough to play against, physicality, he brings all those things on a daily basis and uh, he's a great uh, example of, of what Lincoln Stars hockey uh, is and, and what it should be so um, it's great to have him back you know obviously we want him to have input to be engaged in the locker room and then when he gets the opportunity to play in a game I have uh, no question that he'll be who he always has been. Yeah, he's a huge essence to have back in the locker room I know personally I was extremely excited to hear that he was coming back uh, he's a great person and a great player and a great leader that's going to be very good to have back in the locker room. On the Stars bench, a few players will get to square off against their former teams, with Josh Bowling playing Sioux City for the first time since his trade, as well as Ryan Carmichael and Ross Mitten playing Fargo for the first time since being dealt to the Stars. From an individual standpoint, I was traded in this league, and um, I know that when I played the team that I was traded from, uh, I was always making sure that I was on my game because I wanted to prove to them they made a mistake and I wanted to prove to my new team that they made the right move and uh, I expect our guys that are in this locker room to be no different, to have a point to prove um, and then I expect the guys that, that we traded to, to be excited for the opportunity to show their new team that um, you know they can beat the Lincoln Stars, their former team. So. Both, both sides of the equation, guys are going to be up for it, they're going to be excited for that game. Yeah, it'll be nice to see those guys again. Uh, I don't think, I mean, I, I'm sure I know them as players and people, they're going to be happy to see us as well, but they've got a job to do too, and we're going to think the same way. It'll be nice to see them, but respectively, we both got jobs to do, and I don't think it'll get in the way of anything. It's a big game for those guys who came to us from those teams as well. I'm sure they've had it circled for a little while now, and as they should, it'll be a fun time for them playing against some teammates and, and some former uh, and the former organization. Um, but I'm I'm sure they'll be amped up for it and they'll be pretty excited to play those games. For your game day preview, brought to you by Halls Colgan Water. My name is Tim Mulhaupt. We'll see you at the rink.